Hey, I'm Brad McDonald. I'm a chef here in London, uh, Shotgun Barbecue in Lockhart. I'm here to talk to you today about barbecue in this beautiful London weather. So there's some words that we need to use to, to sort of establish basically what are two main subgroups of barbecuing. Barbecue just means simply cooking over fire. They're both barbecue, right? But for the sake of this conversation, this is grilling and this is smoking. But where I'm from, we cook slow and low. So we use a smoker. Here, when you go out for a barbecue with your friends, typically in your backyard, what you're doing is grilling. Really hot coals and you're cooking directly over high heat. And that's the primary difference between what we refer to as barbecue in the US and what's referred to as a barbecue here in the UK. What kind of meats are you gonna cook on this grill? The naturally tender cuts of meat. Filet, sirloin, ribeye are going to cook really well over high heat. They're naturally tender. But when we swap over here, we wanna use slow and low ambient temperature. So we're taking tougher cuts of meat that are gonna take a lot longer period of time to break down. We're talking about things like ribs, Jacob's ladder, brisket, cheeks, joints, all those pieces of meat that are naturally tough but need a long time in order to uh, tenderize. When you're grilling, you're looking for caramelization, you're looking for that hard char on the outside. When you're smoking, you're looking for that bark, which takes place over the course of a couple of hours as the crust is slowly dehydrating and you're layering those bits of smoke over and over and over again. So now that you've got your techniques down, whether smoking or grilling, it's all about the development of flavor. And that's why I like to use Tabasco, because it really enlivens dishes and makes the end product that much better. So enjoy your summer barbecue, come rain or shine. <laughs>